Good morning. My name is G.S. Raju. I'm a faculty at the University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center, Houston. I joined this great institution in 2009 after serving the University of Texas Medical Branch in Galveston since 2001. I'm grateful to Dr. Strohlein, Dr. Gagel, Dr. Burke, Dr. Du Bois, and President John Mendelssohn for giving me an opportunity to pursue my passion in the prevention of colon cancer at the University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center. My group is led by Dr. Lopa Mishra. I'm pleased to share with you that my colleagues are internationally recognized for their pioneering work in the treatment and prevention of GI cancers. Our practice and our endoscopy unit is located in the Lee Clark Clinic. Lee Clark served as the first president of this great institution with the distinction and laid foundation for excellent care. Our team in the endoscopy unit takes great pride in providing compassionate care. Let me take a moment to thank Linda, Valerie, Sally, Ruth, Anne, and Paula for posting their questions on the Facebook about colon cancer prevention. This is my first video blog, so please bear with me. I'll give my best shot. Let us talk about colon cancer, colonoscopy, and colon cancer prevention. Here is colon cancer. Stuck someone without giving any warning signs. No symptoms at all. Another, another one with the same story. Again, with no warning signs. Hence, it is important to get screened. In order to provide better understanding of the topic and help you refer to online resources, I've used the following resources from the University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center website and also from the American Society for Gastrointestinal Endoscopy, the premier institution for endoscopists from all over the world. Let's go back to Lee Clark. I'm fascinated by Lee Clark and became a great fan of Lee Clark after reading this book, Making Cancer History by James Olson. When I was reading and I came to this page, I was saddened to learn that on May 3rd, 1994, Lee Clark was diagnosed with colon cancer. This could have been prevented. and maybe we could have reversed the history. You tie colon cancer by getting screened and by encouraging others to get screened. In the next video, I would like to answer the questions posed by my friends on the Facebook. Thank you.